week, we're going to do a watercolor painting. But first, we're going to read one of my favorite books. This is just simply called The Painter. And it's by Peter Catalanano. And it is just got great pictures and they're watercolor paintings. So we can go through this nice book and look at all their pictures. And then we're going to do a little watercolor painting of our own of a vase full of flowers. Come look at the book with me. The Painter. So look, this is a watercolor painting. There's dad. There's the child. Looks like they're at the pond with the ducks. And there's mom taking pictures. My daddy is a painter. He paints pictures in his studio. A studio is a room where artists make their artwork. Look up here in the house. There's dad with his easel and he's painting a picture. That must be where he works. The Painter by Peter Catalano. Look at, there's his brush and his paints and his easel. Every morning we make breakfast. We are very good cooks. I love this little dog over here who's trying to sneak a pancake. We love to read the comics and laugh so hard we fall off our chair. Silly, says Mommy. Funny, says me. I asked Daddy if we can go feed the ducks. Not today, says Daddy. Can we play hopscotch? Not now, says Daddy. Do a puzzle? Not yet, says Daddy. Then he goes up to work in his studio, where I am not allowed. It's too dangerous, Daddy says. You might get hurt. At lunch, I ask Daddy what he is painting. A car, says Daddy, a blue one. Yesterday, he painted a butterfly. Once, it was a Dalmatian. We love to dance after lunch. We are very good dancers. Silly, says Mommy. Funny, says me. I asked Daddy if we can kick the ball over the house again. Not today, says Daddy. Fly our kite? Not now, says Daddy. Make a tent? Not yet, says Daddy. Then he goes to work in his studio. At night, it's my job to yell, supper time! After supper, Daddy hangs a spoon on his nose and turns lemons into apples. Looks like he's hiding that lemon back there and he'll exchange it for an apple. That's a fun trick. I do magic too. I tell Daddy that I have lost my hand and he looks everywhere for it. Look, he's looking in the dog's mouth for her hand. I give up, says Daddy. Ta-da, says me. We are very good magicians. I asked Daddy if we can do a puppet show. Not now, says Daddy. Can we read a book? Not yet, says Daddy. Paint a picture? Not yet. Here, says Daddy. Where do you paint the picture? In the studio. Here. Look, there's the paints and an easel and the water. Ta-da! Mommy loves my picture. She says it looks like you'll be a painter when you grow up. I tell her I am a painter now. There's her picture. That's fantastic. And I love this ending to the book where the pictures are on the refrigerator and look who is enjoying the pictures. The end.
Now we will do a little watercolor painting of our own. So I'm ready to start painting my flowers with watercolor paints. I have a brush, I have some water, and I have a paper towel. You can print out the handout from the email I sent. These paints haven't been used today, so they're very dry. I'm gonna start by putting a little bit of water into each color so that they start to soften up and I can paint with them. All right, we'll give them just a minute to start getting soft. Now, remember, we've used watercolor paints before. We're gonna talk about that rhythm that we use to get the watercolor paints. They have to have water, that's why they're called watercolor paints. So I'm going to dip my brush in the water first, then dip my brush into the color. Remember, we're not going to go all the way down to the metal part, just the bristles of your brush, and then I can paint on my paper. I like to outline first, and then fill in the middle. Now, if I wanna change colors, I rinse my brush off in the water, give it a bath, dry it off in the paper towel to make sure all the color's out, and then go to the next color. So I can go water, paint, paper. There we go. Rinse, dry, water, paint, paper. Water, paint, paper. Water, paint, paper. Remember, it's a pattern. Water, paint, paper. Now you can put any color you would like to on your flowers. They're all starting to bloom right now, so the flowers have all kinds of terrific colors. And you can paint into these and see what kind of colors you can come up with. My flowers are in a vase. A vase is a container that holds flowers in the house. You can paint the vase too. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Send me your pictures. Bye-bye.